Hi, I'm, I'm Richard O'Driscoll. I'm the Cabinet Member for Housing at West Suffolk Council. And today I'm looking around a recently refurbished building that specifically for uh, people who become homeless, uh, both families and, and individuals. Um, and the council is determined to make those people stay as comfortable as possible. It's an enormously stressful time uh, when people lose their homes. Um, it affects all the family, it causes huge stress um, and people are generally going through a pretty tough time. What we're aiming to do is to try and support those people as best we can through providing a decent environment that provides them with dignity and practical support. The, the people who become homeless are very mixed, so I've mentioned families, but we also have older people and people with disabilities, um, and, our, and our provision in this building has included facilities to support people in that situation. Um, looking around, I'm delighted with the work that's been done. It's to a very high standard. It supports people's dignity and supports their individuality, and generally tries to make their stay as comfortable as possible in what we know is a difficult time for them. So we're particularly delighted with the kitchen facilities. We recognise that at any one time there will be a number of families in this building um, and we want to provide sufficient space and facilities to enable them uh, to live as independently as they can. Uh, they've done an excellent job here. Um, we've also taken care to uh, use whatever environmental uh, measures we can we recognise it's important for all of our buildings to conserve energy um, and so we, we've taken steps to make sure that we've met all of the latest standards. So generally I think we're delighted uh, with what we've done here. We recognise sadly that this work will need to go on because the cost of living crisis is likely to be with us for some time. Um, but I think we've made a really good start in the last year.